Hi, I'm Dr. Stan Kucher, the Sun Life Financial Chair in Adolescent Mental Health at IWK Health Center in Dalhousie University. Thanks for taking the time to listen. I'm going to be talking a little bit about how can we differentiate a bad hair week from a mental disorder. It's a really important issue. But before I, I, I get onto that, I just want to talk about a phenomenon that we're seeing which is getting to be more prevalent and more concerning and that is the building relationship between the normal stresses of everyday life and the idea that uh, any problem is a mental health problem. That's <laughs> just not correct. You know, sometimes there are things that happen in life which give us negative emotions and give us pause and give us challenges, that's normal. That is not a mental disorder. We don't need to medicalize things. I hear kids talking, oh my gosh, I've been so traumatized. Uh, Jane wore the same colored dress that I wore. I'm traumatized. They're not traumatized. They're having a social challenge. Um, I hear, my gosh, my OCD is acting up. They're not talking about obsessive compulsive disorder. They're talking about they're very meticulous and that's a good thing. They're talking, oh, I'm so schizophrenic. They don't mean that they have schizophrenia. They mean that they are being pulled in different directions at the same time. Recently heard a young man talk about how depressed he was because he didn't make the basketball team at school. He wasn't depressed as in depression. He was unhappy, demoralized, disgruntled. Michael Jordan was cut from his high school basketball team. He didn't become depressed. He became a better basketball player. So we, we have to stop this, this social creep of medicalizing real life. Life has its challenges. Life has, has its difficulties. Life has lots of bad hair weeks. It's got a lot of bad hair days, and sometimes it has bad hair months. But you know what? That's not a mental illness. It's a bad hair month. And, you know, there is a great quote from Winston Churchill that I really like. I'll share that with you. It says, when you're going through hell, keep going. Just because things are stressful, just because life is challenging, it doesn't mean you have a mental disorder. It means you have a challenge and stressor in your life that you have to deal with. Bring in your family, bring in your friends, and deal with it and, 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 and work on it. So how do we tell the difference between a bad hair week and a mental disorder? Well, you know, a mental disorder has very specific signs and symptoms that cause substantial functional impairment that's persistent over time and that response to standardized treatments that have been evidence-based and we know are likely to help. A bad hair week is a bad hair week. There's a big difference. Thanks for listening. I'm Dr. Stan Kucher.